Welcome to the fourth installment of AWF Adrenaline. This episode will feature live bouts from AWF at the Factory One with Tama Williams versus Dean Draven, Freddie Falco taking on Chainsaw, and Blake Stone against the Samoan Warrior. At September Spectacular, the allied tag team of Falco and Lindstrom were outspoken about their recent loss of the Tag Team Championships. Let's see what they had to say. Ensued, featuring a variety of weapons, and after a brutal anything goes war, Gladiator Apollo was able to summon the strength to overcome Falco and lead the beast of the Colosseum to retaining their tag team titles. The Allied tag team has protested the bout and recent title change and had these words for Draven and Apollo. Time and time and time again, ladies and gentlemen, all it seems like's happening is Falco and I are getting screwed each and every night we step into that ring. And we're not going to stand for it anymore. And quite frankly, we're sick and tired of it. Gladiator Apollo, Dean Draven, apparently you can do whatever you like around here. Well, you know what? We are not going to stand for it anymore. In fact, Falco and I, we don't remember signing any contract to wrestle you for the Tag Team Championships. Did that happen? No, that didn't happen. No, they no, not take place. that didn't happen. And in fact, Falco and I, we're looking into legal representation to see just what our options are about that night. 
But enough about that. Let's talk about your new tag team champions for a second. Like they can come out here and they can steal Elite's championships. They can beat Blake Stone in a two on one match. Wow, that's fantastic guys. And the best thing, they can bring a trash can of weapons to the ring and they can take the titles back, right? The titles we deserve. Well guys, you can steal our championships, you can take our championships, but you cannot take this canvas. This one's underway, Young Lions action, flying Freddy Falco taking on Chainsaw. The hat coming into play to start this one off. Should be one hell of a Young Lions bow. Chainsaw being quite the terrors of late. He's going to be locking horns with his former tag team partner, Hair versus Hair at Parramatta RSL on the 23rd of November. I cannot wait to see what happens in that one. It's going to be an all-out war. Those guys used to be great friends, but uh, that friendship is has uh, is been thrown out the window, that's for sure, and uh, somebody's going to lose their hair, so please be on hand for that one at Parramatta RSL. Freddie Falco, he's had an unfortunate last couple of months as well was tag team champions for a couple of seconds, defeated party tricks, ended their uh, over a year reign, and then uh, it all came crashing down as the Beast of the Coliseum uh, entered the, uh, the Penrith Panthers building and uh, cashed in uh, Dean Draven's uh, win at Best of the Best. Best of the Best now available on AWF Home DVD, by the way, so pick that one up, but uh, that was a great card. And then, uh, as we saw a little earlier, Falco and Lindstrom, they tried to, uh, yeah, I guess regain the, the tag team titles in a, in a big hardcore match that took place at Parramatta RSL. Weren't successful, and now they're claiming foul play, and uh, they've got all kinds of excuses and want another rematch, so we're going to see what happens there. But uh, Falco here today in singles action, this guy's quite a character to say, listen, oh, sneaky tactics there. Uh, he's caught him in that front face, like coming back into the ring. Takes him into the corner now. Falco, of course, an integral part of a light wrestling. They'd love nothing more than to bring the Young Lions Championship. Whoa! Big flapjack driver there from Shane, so it dropped him right in his head. A win here could get him a shot at uh, Detective Magnum Holmes, that's for sure. Holmes, he's uh, been uh, amassing the victories as a way. He is a great Young Lions champion, that's for sure, and uh, we're looking forward to uh, to seeing what uh, the end of the year has in store for Detective Magnum Holmes and Young Lions Championship. Such a, a great array of Young Lions stars uh, in the AWF. A good former champion, of course, Diego Del Fugo, Elite Wrestling's greatness, Grant Lindstrom, Falco's tag team partner. He'd love nothing more than to be the Young Lions champion. Whoa, over the top rub. Shane just gets rid of him. Freddy Falco flies, that's for sure. What are you doing, fat man? Ever? Dax and Cage from Western Australia. He's keen to get into that Young Lions uh, picture. He'll be appearing at the uh, the Parramatta RSL event on the 23rd as well. And, of course, uh, we're going to be heading up to Brisbane for Supernova in a couple of weeks. Uh, there's the High Flying Mystery up there and a number of other competitors that are, uh, you know, Dying to get a Young Lions championship Seven. shot, so uh, this one could be quite a uh, an interesting affair. Shane saw, of course, looking for momentum into that. Oh, and he just drops down upon that neck. That top strand just under the chin of Shane saw, but still oh, has the presence of mind just to knock Falco back off the apron into the crowd. There we see one of our great fans, Brian Lering, and his uh, fantastic son Michael. Those guys are. Uh, Definitely great supporters of the AWF and we love seeing them at our events and all our great fans across Australia. We love catching up with you. Supernova is a great opportunity to do that. Oh, and a big boot straight into the neck of Shane Saw. Pretty soon we'll be heading into the end of uh, 2012 and what a year it's been. Plenty of title changes, plenty of action. Aussie Mania 2, what an event that was. That's available on AWF Home DVD. And uh, the main of that event of that one, Iron Ben Cottles versus uh, Powerhouse Theo, was one of the greatest matches in AWF history. Please get online and, and purchase that one. If you're really keen, get to an upcoming AWF event and you can get that great 
ticket and DVD combo, and you may be able to score that one. Falco, great fight in the arm and just stretching the neck of Shane Saw right now. Dodgy Con Robinson just ambushed Shane after that uh, recent match at Parramatta RSL. He couldn't believe it. We saw highlights of that earlier and uh, Oh, cocky cover here from Falco. There's no way he's going to pin Shainsaw. Shainsaw's too much of a scrapper to get pinned like that. I want to make mention of the AWF School of Pro Wrestling. We're uh, taking enrollments now. We're going to be training out at, at Penrith in New South Wales uh, early next year. New beginners classes are going to be taking place. We're going to have a number of new uh, wrestlers beginning next year as well that have been training the NFL School of Pro Wrestling during 2012. So please get in contact with us from there. Also, if you're a, an under-16, we've got the Dream Camp, which will be taking place early next year. So uh, please send us an email at info at awfwrestling.com.au. Let us know that you want to be part of the AWF School of Pro Wrestling, and we'll send you some information uh, shortly and get people started for uh, for a great 2013. Over the shoulder backbreaker there by Falco. Shainsaw out the back door though, ducks under again. Oh, a double close like both men go down. Quite an even contest so far. Fans having a great time here at the, uh, at the factory here in the Mia. It's going to be a great return event on, on the 18th of November, so please come and check that one out. Dean Draven's going to be looking to get some revenge. Uh, we saw the Samoan Warrior interfere a little earlier. Well, uh, I've just been told it's going to be uh, Dean Draven versus uh, the Samoan Warrior at uh, AWF The Factory 2, so that's going to be one hell of a bout to uh, keep an eye out for, that's for sure, and uh, see what goes down there if Draven can uh, exact their measure of revenge. Nice combination there from Shane, so he gets a two count. That's it. He's saying that's it. He could be going for that Shane reaction. Shane reaction. That's exactly what it is. Here it comes. Oh, Falco had it scouted. Oh, it goes for the Falcon punch. Nobody's home. Oh, Shane ends the guru's the arm. <laughs> Falco's got a got a broken wing and uh, oh, he's. Moving chairs out of the way. This one, oh, he's got that damn picture again. He loves carrying that around. Very proud of his uh, alike tag team. Shainsaw wants nothing of this. Oh, he's, he's got to crack him with it. Please do us all a favor. Oh, the distraction, though, made it. Oh, Shane reaction. He caught it with it. One, two, three. Oh. Shane Sword back in the winner's circle. That'll shoot him up the, uh, the list of the Young Lions Championship once again. He was unsuccessful against Bagnum Holmes at a recent Parramatta event, but uh, yeah, that one might get him a rematch, that's for sure. Shane Sword with all the momentum heading into his big hair versus hair match against former tag team partner Dodgy Con Robinson and speak of the devil here. Oh! Attacking Shane from behind. Dodgy Khan pushes Mark Love. Stomping the back and front of Shane. This isn't called for. Whoa, what the? Oh, he's bought scissors. He wants to start this thing early. Perhaps Shane, sir, got a couple of, couple of preliminary haircut. to me while I'm sitting on 120 back down to Hume and you'll have one thing to think about. For every action there's an equal and opposite Shane reaction. And you're going to find that first hand in Parramatta. There we hear it. Shane sort of laying down the law. Victorious here at the factory. Heads to Parramatta RSL for November to dismember. Hair versus hair versus dodgy Cod Robinson.
Friday the 23rd of November, 8pm at Parramatta RSL, AWF returns to Parramatta New South Wales for a huge night of live pro wrestling action with November to December. See a wild monsters ball match featuring two giants of professional wrestling as Wayne the Maniac Mattia takes on Massive Q. Witness a hair versus hair grudge match as former tag team partners try to end each other's careers when Chainsaw battles dodgy Con Robinson. And in the main event, the Commonwealth Championship will be defended as the man they call Blakestone challenges current dual AWF champion Iron Ben Coles. All this plus an exciting undercard featuring AWF wrestlers Magnum Holmes, Jay Law and TNT. Tickets available now at the AWF website for $25 or get a score with our ticket and DVD combo deal for just $35. It's AWF November to dismember.